you are losing precious time to find good place to eat while you are traveling, here is the video for you. In a few seconds, we will show you our top 5 restaurants in Ubud, Bali. The first place that we recommend is the restaurant Al Kimi. Their menu is plant-based and gluten-free. Their selection range from some bowl, they have a lot of salads. Today we're here for breakfast, but it's open all day. A plus here is their coffee is delicious. They use a coffee bean called Arabica, which is harvested here in Bali. And it's sustainable and ethically grown and harvested. Yes, please enjoy your breakfast. I chose the fluffy waffle and Mathieu the buttermilk pancake. And the cost for each is 69,000 Indonesian rupiah. It looks almost too beautiful to eat. Very tasteful. Mm. We ate well and now we are at the little store of the restaurant. There are plenty of natural products and beauty care, books, it's really cool. We are going to one of our favorite restaurants in Hubud. The name is Yellow Flower. And the path to go there is really, really nice. This is what I like about Hubud, is that you can find cute restaurants in little alleys all over the place. We've been here for almost a month and every day we're surprised to find a very beautiful restaurant or new terrace. So here we are. We especially love this place because they have their own garden. So the food here is organic and local. Another thing that we appreciate is the view. One morning, we even saw the Mount Agun. It's a volcano. So we took Nazi Kampur. It's a really popular dish here in all around Indonesia and Bali. It's a mix of rice, coconut, sambal, and there are some kind of vegetables. So let's try. You have to mix a bit everything. Mm. I love it. I think it's the best one that we had. We just finished at Yellow Flower restaurant, 
still, like always, a very good experience. I really recommend for myself the Energy Smoothie Bowl. It's packed with banana, dragon fruit, nuts, even dates. We took two Nazi Kampur, one smoothie bowl, a coffee and an iced tea and the total cost us 250,000 Indonesian rupiah. This is Layana Wahun. It's situated about 10 minutes outside the city of Ubud. We have a perfect view of the waterfall while eating. My recommendation here is the Migoren. Migoren is a stir fry with chicken and vegetable with fried egg. Here they even add some satay, which is a grilled stick of chicken. The price is approximately three US dollars. Next on our list of best restaurants in Ubud, we are at a Warun. Warun means in Indonesian, a local restaurant that's usually family owned. That's where the best place to find Indonesian food at a very affordable price. The name of the Warun is Murnis Warun. The restaurant is situated next to the jungle. As you eat, you can see big palm trees, birds flying around. It's beautiful. We decided to take for appetizers lumpia and satay. For the main course, we took ayam pangang and a chicken tom seng. It's like a soup made of stir-fried chicken in a spiced mixture of garlic, turmeric and candle nut. This is a famous satay. It's chicken that we put on the grill to cook for a long time. What's particular with this one is that they even bring you a small grill at the table so they keep it warm. We've been here before and we know that it's super good and it's one of uh, Sarah's favorite, the satay. Mm. Amazing, with the peanut sauce, perfect combination. There are always lumpias in the menu if you go to a local restaurant and we never tried it. Mm. It's really good. The exterior is crunchy and in the middle you can find many vegetables and chicken. I'm curious about the coconut tongue sandwich. The flavor of the coconut and the lemongrass is incredible. <laughs> We are right in front of the Pomegranate Cafe. Uh, it's a restaurant that we really enjoy because it's right in the middle of the rice field. The path to come here, it's beautiful. 
It's very green. There's palm tree, there's rice field. So what's particular with this one is that you can really relax, have a look at the rice field. There's nothing in front. There's no car, no noise. It's very beautiful. The food is good. We'll show you what we can eat here. So this is Pomegranate Cafe. There are many types of food here. You can find tacos, pizzas, Indian curries, of course, Indonesian food, and dumpling too. We receive our plate and it looks amazing. I agree. For myself, I got the Indian curry. It's a tomato and onion coconut cream curry. There's different vegetables inside. There's zucchini, mushroom, eggplants, and I got myself on the side a black sticky rice. On my side, I have dumplings. I taste and it's really good. All right, let's dig in. The whole meal, we had one Indian curry, one dumpling, one coconut, and one juice, fresh juice. All of that cost us 200,000 Indian rupee. It was a perfect combination with the view, relaxation, and the food. I really recommend coming from the sunset because the sun goes straight on the rice field. Today we came during lunch. Last time we were here, we were here at sunset and it was a very good experience. We can't finish the video without showing you this amazing coffee. Keliki is situated just outside of central Ubud. It's a beautiful 10 minutes motorbike ride along the rice fields. Not only the view of the jungle is absolutely stunning, the coffee is actually by far our favorite in the area. Thanks for watching and see you in the next episode!